We need a systematic change in the use and recovery of resources to assure competitiveness and the jobs of the future. This entails keeping resources in use for as long as possible, extracting maximum value from them, and regenerating materials from products at the end of their life cycle. Much remains to be done to improve the quality of the air we breathe and of the waters in our lakes, rivers, and oceans. Our citizens continue to suffer from the effects of air pollution, especially in urban centers. They deserve that the necessary action will be taken. I was born and brought up in a fishing village in the south of Malta, an island heavily dependent on marine economy. I therefore have some personal understanding of the concerns of fishermen and the importance of the sea for the economy of many regions in the European Union. We have collectively agreed to achieve maximum sustainable yields by 2015, where possible, latest by 2020. The sooner, the better. This means putting in place the multi-annual plans and a regionalization that maintains the European nature of the policy while respecting the particularities of each fishing region. I believe that environment, maritime affairs and fisheries are a natural fit. Green growth and blue growth are two sides of the same coin. Sustainability is the key principle in all areas of my portfolio with its economic, social and environmental dimensions. Together with you can be achieved. If confirmed, I hope I can also count on you as my partners in getting it done. Thank you very much for listening.